Thank you for tuning in to our demonstration on MCR Console. Today we're concentrating on the module for your advanced analytics and reporting. Within the advanced reporting, we can check out your comparative reports, view your trends, and set targets against them. Check out your consolidated dashboard, your operational calendar, which also accounts for the weather, your sales and product mix data, loss prevention reports, and you have full export functionality. Above are 2,000 plus reports that you can get through NCR Silver and NCR Silver Pro Restaurant. That's over 250 reports. So let's go check out this module. Now, once again, the login to view these areas is store.ncrconsole.com. Immediately, you're presented with your dashboard. Now, what's unique about your dashboard is that if you have diversified business interests, meaning you have one business on Silver and another on NCR Silver Pro Restaurant, you can actually combine their information here through NCR Console. It's all data, and we can mess with the dashboard by either viewing all of our optional stores or isolating one over the other. Within the dashboard, we have the ability to view alerts such as messages from your employee's employee portal. We can compare your sales by day, by week, have a current sales performance forecasted, your comparison of sales, checks, average check, and guests. We can also view the day's schedule if your employees have been scheduled for the week, weather forecast information, your sales forecast, and today's labor against your targeted or different. To go more in depth with your analytical data, we also need to check out your day-to-day -day calendar. Within this day-to-day -day calendar, we can view the weather immediately. But if we need to switch to a different year or time, we can view our sales information combined with the weather. Notice we can click into each day and then further click into different product mix and hourly sales. We can also edit each day to account for any additional um, funds that we're trying to collect outside of our sales. For example, we have a breast cancer donation jar and we have just a general donation jar for the kids' soccer team. The manager can even put in notes. Or we could go further within our options and hit the day settings to mark if a day was closed or a holiday. We can also view the employee time cards of who worked that day. Now this calendar is a lot of information and you can really use it for your manager reporting tools, but it would get tedious to keep on clicking in day to day. So just know that under reports, there's a day to day option where you can go in, locate the day to day report and export all that information that was shown on the calendar, including any additional notes that have been put in place. Now, as promised, you can check out your progress and set um, targets against them within the planning area. Here, we can set up a target for your labor as well as your sales. So set those sales goals and see how well you meet them. Or exceed, really, because we want you guys to do more than well. Within the reporting section itself, we can view sales reports, our daily summary, labor and inventory, other data, such as the reports on your transaction count and any custom data that you've set up for your store, key indicators, such as any red flags or cleared items options, day-to-day, -day, which is our operational history we just looked at, and any other reports that you need to look at for your store that are kind of miscellaneous, including any price overrides or shift details. Now let's take a look at our daily summary. Within our daily summary, we can view the information of how well we sold. Here we can see our total sales broken down by net sales, cash balance, tender type, your product sold, any red flag reporting, which are not really red flags, but just advisory reports. We'll have your full employee breakdown as well as your shift breakdown. And while it is nice to come back here and look at the reports, 
Let's take it a step further by looking at our notifications. Under notifications, this allows you to email or text message, depending on the options, your daily summary, detailed daily summary, sales entry, unrecognized time card user, inventory par level report, as well as inventory reorder point report. The main owner will be notified of this, but if you need any additional uh, recipients to receive this, you can always add the recipients from your employee information. Now, if you have any further questions, you're more than welcome to reach out to the NCR Silver team, or you could also check out help.ncrconsole.com. Help Once you go to help.ncrconsole.com, we have all of the articles related to every module present, including release notes. Have a great day.